Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. So today I want to make a quick video talking about the duffel bags in GTA Online because it's been a month and a week basically at this point since the duffel bags have been removed from the game. And a lot of people are, were wondering where are the duffel bags? If you've been playing, you know, GTA in the last month and you've been selling a lot of MC businesses, you will have noticed this, that there are no bag missions whatsoever. The only type of missions are non-bag missions, and because of that, you are much more likely to get harder missions. Now, with the MC businesses, there's actually three bag missions. There's the bag mission where everybody makes a different drop, single drop, there's the bag mission where everybody races to one single drop, and then there's the third bag mission where everybody um, goes to three different drops, and basically everybody's carrying three product in those bags. And Ever since, like, you know, early January, like the first week of January, the duffel bag missions have been taken out of the game. It's not a glitch. They've been taken out of the game by Rockstar. And this is not permanent. Rockstar, I'm sure they're going to they're gonna add the missions back eventually. But the reason that they've taken these missions out of the game is because they're trying to fix a glitch. And it's kind of strange because this glitch has been in the game for, you know, years now. But at least, you know, they're trying to fix it. And, you know, Rockstar has been busy this past month. They've been fixing, you know, trying to fix the animal spawns on Red Dead, trying to fix some glitches with that. And they've also patched, you know, God Mode glitches on GTA. And they've been patching some other glitches on GTA. So they are making an effort. But, you know, it's been a month and a week. And because of that, we have a lot harder missions to deal with. Now the glitch that Rockstar is trying to fix is they're trying to fix the black screen, you know, invite glitch with the MC business. If you're unfamiliar with this, basically what happens is say that somebody is selling their MC business, right? And they go inside their MC business, they send everybody in their MC an invite. The people in the MC accept the invite and they're on a black screen loading in to the MC business. But the second that guy who's the owner of the MC business, he invites them, he activates the sale before the people even connect. If he activates the sale before people connect, what happens at that point is the people get stuck on an infinite black screen and they cannot exit the MC business. But the host and anybody else that's inside the MC business, they are actually able to exit the MC business and they have duffel bags on them. But the other people that are trapped in the MC business and stuck in a black screen, they technically have duffel bags. It says that they have it, but they're inside the MC business. And at that point, basically the mission is ruined. Those people cannot exit the MC business and they cannot deliver the product. And if they try to leave the session, what actually happens is that product gets deleted and the host gets gets less money. Now, this has been a glitch that's been in the game for almost, you know, three years, three years and about about three, four months. So it's been there since October 2016 with the bikers update. So it's good that Rockstar is fixing it. It's kind of strange that they're doing it three years later. But that is the reason that the duffel bags have been taken out of the game. Now, some people are getting into conspiracies and they're saying that, oh, Rockstar just wants it to be harder for us and they want us to do post-op missions. No, I don't believe that. But I do believe, you know, that they should... They should add the duffel bag missions back as soon as possible because I've just been really frustrated this past month trying to do MC businesses. I just really don't feel like doing MC businesses. Not at all. Like, I'm, I'm doing some MC businesses right now. I'm getting ready to document forgery because I've had this sitting for like weeks full and I haven't ever gotten around the chance to sell it. But I have a plane mission here. It's one of the more harder missions, but still I prefer this much more over post-op. But we've been dealing with a lot more harder missions post-op and garbage truck because of the lack of um, duffel bags. And because of that, you're also more vulnerable to other people because if you really rush, you can oftentimes deliver the duffel bags before another player goes after you. So the duffel bags, they are the best MC business mission that you can get. And there's three of them also. So you have the highest chance of getting a duffel bag mission over anything else. But now because they've been deleted, we have a much higher chance of getting some of these harder missions. The easiest mission right now that you can get without the double bag, du duffel bags is the single pounder truck where you just have one truck and just one drop and you just got to drive it to the drop and you're done. That is the easiest mission that you can get. So I really hope that they add these duffel bag missions back as soon as possible. And I'll, I'll say this though, is uh, I don't understand one thing though, and I've noticed a lot of people also voice concern about this, is why isn't the Titan mission taken out of the game? Because this is actually kind of a step in the right direction where when a mission is bugged, Rockstar takes that mission out of the game until they can figure out how to fix it. 
and that's what they've done with the duffel bags. But my question is, why don't they apply that same logic to the CEO crates? Because there's a Titan glitch where you guys, I'm sure you guys are familiar with it. You try to make drops with the Titan. It can also happen with the Cuban plane, but it's much more common with the Titan where you make drops, you hear the little noise, you see the drop being made, but then it doesn't register and the yellow blip doesn't dis disappear from your map. And then at that point, the mission is glitched. It's impossible to make the deliveries. That is a very frustrating mission and ex extremely annoying, especially when you're trying to sell a full crate warehouse. If you have to deal with that, close your application, you lose three crates, you get back on the game, you gotta get three crates again, or you sell it without those three crates. But you still lose something for not being your fault at all. And, you know, this, I, I'll tell you guys something. I actually remember something similar to happening to this. Um, this happened about May 2018, so this is some time ago. And what ended up happening was Rockstar actually deleted raid missions. So they got rid of MC raid missions. They were gone from the game. You could not get raided. And this had this went on for about, like I'd say, a week and a half. It went on for a little bit of time, but it was noticeable. There was no raids whatsoever. I even tested it. I left my PlayStation on for like, you know, five, six hours, and I just walked around in circles, you know, just so I wouldn't get kicked, and I did not get raided. So business raids were out of the game. And that had apparently something to do with the nightclub update because they were testing the nightclub update that was going to launch, you know, two months later, and they took the raid missions out of the game. But one thing that I really don't like about how Rockstar, you know, patches, you know, major glitches and major problems when they do fix them you know i compliment them but sometimes it takes them pretty long but the most frustrating thing is i really hope this is hot fixed this duffel bag issue and that we we can get duffel bags like i hope it's tomorrow even that we get duffel bag missions back but they could possibly you know wait out until the next update i really hope that doesn't happen but it is a possibility it could happen until the next update and that's what's really frustrating about rockstar when they have like a really big you know patch when they have something that they want to fix in the game something you know big they aren't going to fix that until the next update typically and the same thing happens with red dead online when a new update comes out you know that's when you know they fix a lot of the stuff so i really hope we don't have to wait until the next update for them to fix the duffel bags because that would really suck because we're probably not going to get the next update i'd say until you know at least like june june july that's my estimate we could get it earlier than that but i think the next update isn't going to come out until june july and the reason is because rockstar have been doing two major updates a year they do one you know in the middle of the year that's when they did you know the um they did the After Hours DLC in July 2018, then they did Arena Wars December 2018, and they did the same thing in, they did the exact same thing in 2019, July 2019, we had a Casino DLC, December 2019, we had the Casino Heist DLC, so they're probably going to add, they're probably going to add this patch with the next update i just hope it doesn't really take long but let me know what you guys think down below i've just been grinding casino heists with my friends been doing the heist and just helping people out with their heists i really just don't feel like doing the mc businesses at this point because i know that i'm gonna get the post-op mission much more than usual and we've been helping people out on streams a lot too i still help people out on streams but it's just frustrating when you just get a post-op mission and then you help the next person and you get a post-op mission again and each mission takes like 15 minutes it's just annoying but let me know what you guys think down below what do you think of like rockstar fixing the duffel bag why don't you think you know the titan glitch is fixed i do compliment rockstar for what they're trying to do that they're trying to fix something in the game hopefully they don't take too long but let me know what you guys think down below if you guys enjoyed the video drop a like if you're new to my channel enjoy my content subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one take care everyone